Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, I'm Kristen Dominique and welcome to a day in my life. I feel like I shouldn't be showing you guys this, but I am because this is my real life. <laughs> a hot, hot mess. But I'm getting ready right now for Jaden's football game. I already did my hair. Just curled it a little bit and now I'm just like doing some natural light makeup and we should be ready to go. Brush your teeth and wash your hair. Okay, before I head out, I want to show you guys what I'm wearing. My top is from Meshki and it's just like a cute little cardigan. And then my jeans are from Zara. My favorite jeans, I got a link them below. They fit so good. These are my jeans. They are so comfortable, they fit so good. And the shoes. And then my shoes are from Louis Vuitton. They're just like these little sneakers. I love sneakers. Can you guys see? I don't know. These are my shoes. A little up close moment. I'm like a designer sneaker person. I love designer sneakers. This is my outfit. Got a little foundation on my pants, but that's okay. So I've been really loving this clear bag. I actually only wore it because I needed it for the BTS concert. So I just grabbed like a random clear purse. But after I wore it, it kind of grew on me and I haven't been able to put it down since I went to the BTS concert, which was like a few months ago. And it just, it's cute. It's from Miss Lola. So I always have this with me. And I have my little face mask in there, my wallet, my keys, some lip balm, and then a Listerine strips. So that is my outfit. And then I'm wearing the Way. I don't know how to say that. This is my perfume for the day. I change my perfume every day along with my jewelry. So my jewelry is from Dre Collection. This choker i've been loving their jewelry I'm wearing it like every day so i'll link that as well their earrings are super cute these are from bethany moda's line i'll link it below and then this is from irene me collection my evil eye necklace i get a lot of questions on this necklace all right so this is my outfit and i'm gonna go ahead and head out so we're early and Jaden is just practicing so there's these little food trucks and i'm about to get a latte Caesar and I got all the things we need for the game and we're walking over now because it's actually started. chilling watching TV. I had lunch already, I had just like a sandwich and chips. Jaden's making pizza over there. Very, very chill day. I, oh my God, you guys. I have been drinking these. I got these in from Alani. Alani, I don't know how to say it, but they sent me a bunch of these. They're caffeine free, sugar free, like zero everything. And they taste so good. It's like a peach sparkling water. It's so good. And they have like, I'm gonna show you. They sent me so many and now I'm addicted. This is also a really yummy flavor. This is not sponsored. They just sent them to me and I really love these. I just wanted to share that with you guys. We literally just sat here all day, laid down and watched a ton of Netflix. I watched I Am Georgina, Cristiano Rolando's wife's life when i was younger i had the biggest crush on cristiano and it's just cool to see like his family and life and everything now then after that i went on tiktok and i was just scrolling and watching how people prepare their meals and organize but now we're gonna go eat and i have no idea where we're gonna go but let's see we decided to get sushi tonight and we got a little bit of appetizers Okay, so last night I forgot to end my vlog and most importantly show you guys my nighttime skincare routine Which is why I was so excited to do this video so I could show you guys how I have improved my skin But it worked out because I do have an appointment this morning with nurse Jamie who has also helped my skin texture 
over the years i've been going to her for like three years and she's really helped my skin texture with the laser frequency we've been doing so i want to show you guys that we're gonna go visit nurse jamie in santa monica so it's about an hour ride jaden's coming with me and we're gonna go and get some starbies and then head over to nurse jamie So I got to Brentwood super early. Actually, I thought it was Santa Monica, but we're in Brentwood. So Jaden and I decided to get some breakfast. We're currently waiting for our sandwiches, but we got some little Starbucks, got a frap. But I wanted to show you guys my outfit. <laughs> <laughs> show your frap, show your frap. Look at the frap, so yummy. So I'm gonna show you guys my outfit. My glasses are from Desi and they are the on red. This is such a cute shade. And then my outfit, the whole thing is from White Box. Just some little joggers, very comfortable Sunday kind of vibe. And then my shoes are from Miss Lola. Did you get the shoes, Jaden? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, go back up. So yeah, that's basically my whole outfit. And then I'm still wearing the same clear bag from yesterday because this is just like my everyday bag now. And a little mask because we're about to go pick up our sandwiches. Okay, so we're gonna eat in the car because there's no seating areas around this area. We're... What is he doing? What? This guy just like <laughs> randomly came and put his drink on my car. That was weird. This is very LA <laughs> for something like this to happen. Sweet little older man. Anyway, so I'm gonna show you what we got to eat and drink. We're gonna show Jaden's first because his is really good. It's a strawberry pistachio. So he got the strawberry cream frap and it has pistachio sauce and then pistachio topping. This is so good. It tastes like, what does it taste like? Like a toffee pastry or something. It tastes so good. You guys have to try it if you have a sweet tooth. And this is a cream frap, so obviously there's no coffee in it. I actually don't drink any coffee either. I Well, I do, but I, I drink only decaf because I was diagnosed with Barrett's esophagus about a, um, almost like a year ago and I had to change the way I eat and drink. So any acidic foods, any caffeine that's gonna create a lot of acid in my stomach to come up to my throat, I cannot have. So I opted for decaf and decaf is not the same. This looks very unpleasant and it honestly doesn't taste very good right now. These are a hit or miss. I make them the best at home because I know how much decaf to put in there, but sometimes it just tastes like brown water, which is, not good, but I got a iced decaf, pistachio sauce, two pumps of vanilla, and sweet cream cold foam on top. And then we got some breakfast sandwiches from Bellwood Cafe. And they're just bacon, egg, and cheese. They look so good. Look at this. Yes. We're gonna eat really quick. And then I'm gonna go get my skin done by Nurse Jamie. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm gonna eat now, because I don't think I'm ever gonna eat. It's already been five minutes I'm talking. We finally found parking over there and <laughs> it's such a tiny little area, Brentwood, and like parking is very scarce. So it took us like 30 minutes to find parking, but we're finally here. I'm gonna show you guys what the building looks like. It's so cute. Jaden's gonna be hanging out over there while we get everything set up. So I'm here with the one and only Nurse Jamie. Hi, Sunday. Yes. What do you do? So this first? is new era. This is radio frequency. It causes your collagen fibers to thicken. The overlying skin becomes firmer. It also kills active bacteria. Just because your skin, like if you get like a tiny little uh, blemish, like it tends to leave a mark for a little bit on your skin. Yeah. So this is very healing. Perfect. Okay, so we're gonna get started. All right, so we had a long day of driving in LA. Now I'm gonna get ready for bed. So I'm gonna wash my face and I'm gonna take you through what my skincare routine is. Guys, my skin has changed so much. I used to have really bad acne and from that, I got so many scars on my face that 
I felt like at one point I would just have to accept the way it looks with all the scarring and all the bumps and the texture. I just didn't know like where to go with my skin. But in the past six or seven years, my skin has improved so much. And actually in the past two years, my texture has improved like 80%, so it's insane. So just to let you guys know, I have dry combo sensitive skin. That's my skin type. And everything breaks me out, everything makes me red. So I cut out all cleansers. And I tried, this is life changing, I know it's so simple, but this Dove moisturizing soap has changed my skin. Also the face halo has changed my skin a ton. These two things together, the exfoliation and the amount of dirt that comes out onto this pad is insane. And this is just such a bare, simple type of soap. I don't know what the science is behind it, but I don't break out. My texture has never looked better. Now I have been going to Nurse Jamie for the past few years when my skin has been looking better and I do the laser skin resurfacing and I just do little tiny increments and skin tightening and everything like that. So my skin is looking way better than what it used to look. I'm gonna go ahead and wash my face now because I feel like I've been talking forever. But basically I just get the Dove soap. If I have makeup on, I'll use this Tatcha cleansing oil or any like kind of cleansing oil. I like this one because it's pretty soft on my skin and I have sensitive skin so it just helps break down all the makeup and all the dirt so that it just kind of easily melts away. Basically that's all I had on my face today was brows and tiny tiny bit of concealer the NARS Radiant Creamy which is really light coverage. So I just do that and this is just a light little wash and then after that I'll take the Dove Bar Soap, lather it up and just wash my face with it. And once I have it really good on my face, then I'll go ahead and take my face halo and just work it into the forehead, right around the temple. That's where I used to break out so much around my temples, right on my cheek, just everywhere in the little crevice of the nose, right where the crease of the nose is. Sometimes I don't think my face is that dirty and when I look at my face halo and I'm like, oh my God. So if you want to wash it, because I use this like on a daily basis, I'll put it in the washer. I love that I'm not using makeup wipes all the time and throwing those away and cluttering the environment. I wash my face halo with a little soap and I'll go over it about twice. Twice is all you really need to get everything out. Just go around and it gets all the dirt off of your face. Every little bit of it. After that, I'll dry my face. And this is just like a quick little daily nighttime routine. It's not pampering or anything like that. Just an essential routine that cleans my face, gets everything out and makes it healthy and nice and I love it. After that, I'll take my exfoliating toner from Augustinus Batter and I love this stuff so much. I love everything from this brand. Their creams are really nice, their moisturizers, a very expensive brand, but totally worth it. I'll take this in my hands like this and I'll just press it into my face and down my neck and even on my hands because as you get older your hands your chest area like right in here your age shows up on your hands and your chest if you're under 25 it doesn't matter to you but trust me it will matter i just let that sit and dry on my face for a second after that i'll use the egf serum from nurse jamie and just get a little bit of that in my hand to hydrate and I'll have all the benefits on the screen for you guys of this and everything below. So I like to work the serums into my hands, into my arms, a little crazy in my chest, my neck and everything. After that, let that settle down and work into my face and then I'll put on a night cream. I got this in from Charlotte Tilbury in NPR and I was like, what the heck? has everything I need in there, I'm gonna try it out. I've been using it for the past three weeks and I really like it. It's not heavy, it feels ultra hydrating and my skin just loves it. The serum I didn't use today, but if I'm not using that one, I'll use this one. And then you can do the day cream or the night cream. I'm gonna do the night cream. The only thing I'm missing now is the Laneige or Laneige um, lip mask. This is the peach iced tea one. I have this little Valentino brush that I use and I just like pop it on my lip and I am hydrated. Day moment. <laughs> so this is my realistic pajama. Like I don't match every day. That's very like 
planned when I do, or I have like one, one or two, okay, three pajama sets that match and I rarely wear them. I just got like a comfortable shirt, some pajama pants, and I got these really cute slippers, kind of like thick socks that have like a thing on the bottom so you can walk around the house so you don't slip from my mother-in-law and they're so comfy. Took off my earrings and I'm about to go chill right now. I look like I just dunked my head in water, but. We are preserving the youth over here. This is the movie room and I'm just gonna... Okay, it's really dark so you guys can't see, but... We're ending the night right here. Good night, guys. Love you. Thank you for watching. This is Mochi. And this is our movie bear. And our other movie bear. This is Mocha. And that is Mochi. God bless you.